Welcome, people of God. Keep it locked with Thomas B. on the Music Zone, playing the very best in CHH and Christian R&P around. What's up, family? What is good? What's going down? This is your boy, Thomas B., and welcome to another episode of the Music Zone. Glad to see you guys again. I'm got yeah, another two-hour show, man. Again. <laughs> but, yeah. Man, I just got some things in my heart, man. I just want to share, man. But COVID-19, you know, um, has really been always been the talk for right now for at least, man, I'll say months now. I think since around the month of, what, February? <laughs> um, probably been taught even before that, but really hit hard in the month of February, you know, with dealing with COVID-19, um, the coronavirus. But, uh, man, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just amazed at uh, the fact that um, businesses and you know, uh, you know, uh, other working organizations, you know, that has employees are still trying to remain open, um, especially the ones that consider not to be, I guess you could say, mission essential <laughs> uh, for as employees working and you know and all and trying to provide the right necessities like we need. Of course, the food. You know, companies, we need them because we need food, cost of water, you know, uh, of course, the health products and all that kind of stuff. But I'm talking about other other areas that may not consider to be missing essential type businesses and companies that has employees um, are still open right now, even though it's not feasible. It's not it's not very wise right now to continue to have people come to work, still practice the, you know, the, the, the safety of COVID-19 in the working environment, but then after that fact, still yet go home, and then you come back to work, then you find out, then you haven't, start having a repetitive amount of cases concerning COVID-19, which is a lot of other workers that work there can possibly get exposed to uh, the coronavirus, the ones that, especially the ones that came up positive. So it's like, you know, until we, until the businesses or companies get a, get the mind and say, hey, wait a minute, in order to stop this, that means we got to close the plant down for some time to try to get some type of, uh, some type of control over this because it doesn't make sense to. Work a little bit. Got to got to stop when another case incident comes. Got to send everybody home, and then do it all over again. You know, for one, you lost people with time, costs. You know, travel. You know what I mean? It's it's it, it's a lot of waste that we're doing right now, and not being very mindful of this thing. That hey, we got to be smart about what we're doing, and it's just not to me. It's just not proper safety. <laughs> So I, I got to say that right now before we start the show. It's just that one of the things been on my mind, heavy, how we can still try to work through and kind of ignore the signs of, you know, in a, in a working environment, ignore the signs to a point where, okay, put your stuff on. Um, but, you know, after that, you go home, there, there's people out there going to still practice bad, poor uh, practices when it comes to this to prevent others not to get affected, even their families. You know, so I mean, you, you might have kids, you know, you don't want to expose your family to it because, you know, someone in the plant got it and they were not properly taking the right steps in order to close it down instead of keep trying to keep people going. And yeah, I know you want people to make money, but just put everybody on unemployment for a while. You know what I mean? But uh, I'm just saying it's just not, you know, I'm not trying to sound salty or nothing like that, but it's just not wisdom. I mean, I mean, there's a there's a difference between wisdom and fear. OK. You know, I not give you a perfect example. Me being a, a former soldier, why I'm going to help somebody else put their masks on in a, in a, in a, a nuclear biological environment, chemical environment, exposed to where you you got to have it on. And I got mine's off. Of why, by the time I had them put their on, guess what? I could be affected. I could not make it. I could die. You know what I'm saying? So common sense says, hey, you know. Let me do the right thing. Take care of my. Let me do the right thing. Do my part first. 
And then the next thing that I gotta help my brother man get get themselves right. You know, it is the fact that it is the procedures of how we do things in society is just totally totally back. But we can't control we can't control people what we do, I got it. But that's why I say maybe the best thing for businesses and companies to some point look at their point. Eventually you're gonna have to shut down. Eventually you're gonna have to do shut down if you keep running repetitive the same stuff, send people home, you know, of you know, it's still still it's still almost like a waste of time almost. I mean, it really is. Um, um, I'm, I'm just being frank with you. So that's one of the things that was dear near my heart that was bothering me. I hate to take up a lot of part of the show. I know I took up probably like, what, five minutes of your time? But yeah, but anyway, um, we're going to get into the music thing. We're going to kick off the five in a row in a minute. And uh, I just want to give all shout outs to everybody that's listening, all the supporters uh, that's pushing the music zone, um, all the networks out there that you guys have been out. Fab Tabulous, you've been outstanding with uh, the support that you've been giving. You know the Music Zone, and of course it's myself. Um, I really appreciate it, the love, okay, and all you listeners out there. Yeah, definitely. That's a, that's definitely a must have. I have to give you guys a shout out. <laughs> Always deserving that. But most of all, we give all honor to God. <clears throat> you know, what be wrong for me to even not to even uh, say His name <laughs> on the show and give Him honor and and uh, reverence So yeah we give all honor to God For making things All possible concerning the show uh, Concerning you The listeners to be able to come on here and listen And enjoy yourselves and hopefully To be impacted and to minister to Through song and uh, I don't know music or word or something I might have said Or whatever uh, Just appreciate it all <laughs> Now let's think we're going to give God all the glory In the midst of it So Without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get into the music. We're going to kick things off with, I kind of felt like this time, kind of kind of flashback here and there, you know, and uh, I kind of felt like I want to flash back into some music, that good music, but just not having really been heard a lot, you know what I mean? And we got some, we got some music, new music here and there here on the show too, but I want to flash back here and now and there, and uh, I think it's good to do that sometimes. Uh, to, to kind of show um, that the, because it's not like brand new music, but it still it still can be it still can be banging, it still can be ministering, you know, all that good stuff. But but anyway, um, we're gonna kick the show off with uh, I got the five rule. I got I'm gonna kick it off with Kelly Williams with Bionic. That's one of my old jams. Just jam on my on my playlist, and then um, also my, my other my homeboy uh, Chris Cobbins, you know, stack snacking snacking, Frisian Corey Paul. And then my uh, next up after that, I got Warren Campbell with working, man, working. We're going to be working it, okay? And then they're going to have uh, Jared Sanders fishing Bizzle with eyes. I got eyes. I see you. I see you. <laughs> then Lathan Warlick and, uh, with his new one called Fight On. It's a good track. Um, then had a flashback with an old G. You know, uh, <laughs> Hope Dealer. <laughs> Mr. Dale with On God And then following him Then we're going to have Brody With uh, Psycho that's, I think that's his new one That he dropped They got old Brody with uh, Psycho And then remember the other the other one he had was uh, uh, Holy Water But uh, now he has a, a new one now That's called uh, Psycho So uh, and we, so we, we're excited about to jam that on the show um, I'm, I'm just gonna go ahead and go on down the list, man. We got some, we got some new music from Lucas Ryder. We got Kier Sheard. We got man. We got uh, D Black. We got uh, Chris B. Man, we got we got some old Trip Lee. We got some RF Music 208. We got some um, Social Club Misfits. We got a little Kirk Franklin. We got Jimmy Hustle. Man, we got some everything, man. So. But anyway, I, I basically kind of went through the whole mirage of music there. <laughs> but yeah, we will get started with Kelly Williams with Bionic and then following him, Chris Cobbins with Snacking, Warren Campbell with Working, Jared Sanders and Bizzle with Eyes, and Lathan Warlake with Fight On. It's all going down right here, right now. On the music zone.
tracks for the double zero. It's a brand new sound for your town called a new row. She's a biblically intuitive offspring that sings. The eclectic internal carnality. Look, you know I- 